Paul, you stood on a stage with Russell Westbrook just last summer, said, I'm here to stay in Oklahoma City. That was a year ago, though. You signed a four-year contract. It's a three-year plus one. What changed to get to this point where you said, OK, I'm ready to go. I'm going to ask to move on to Los Angeles. Well, it, it was always a mutual um, you know, respect amongst myself, amongst Russ, amongst Sam and uh, Mr. Clay Bennett. Um, we all were on the same page. This was nothing that came out of the blue. The initial plan was to give it another year, see what we could do. I did that, we played another year. Felt like we were just stagnant. And um, you know, the next thing was, you know, let's, let's go forward and, and go on with other plans. And um, Thunder got amazing packages out of it. Um, for myself, for Russ, Houston involved, got great packages. So I, I think it was just a win-win across the board when we all looked at it and thought this was the best moment to, uh, to pull the plug. You know, they, was, they didn't know what direction they was going in after that. You know, we, uh, kudos to the Thunder, man. They, uh, they was very honest with me about the decisions and where they're going in the future. And they let me reevaluate re my situation. Man, here we are today. First and foremost, I just want to thank the whole Thunder organization. Um, Mr. Bennett, Sam Presti, um, for the partnership that we had there. It was a great two years there for me, but, you know, ultimately, they uh, helped me find my way back home to L.A. and uh, very appreciative of that moment. We played, I played two good years there, and, and, you know, it was a mutual thing between both of us that, um, you know, the time was, 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 was up. It's a three-year plus one. We both had ideas of, of doing things differently, so I don't think there's nothing wrong with it. I think it should be a mutual and, and pretty even thing if both parties can be on the same page. You know, they, was, they didn't know what direction they was going in after that. How close were you to maybe going to one of the other two teams you considered? Um, I was very close, uh, real close. Um, you know, um, when they presented the opportunity of playing with Paul, it was, it was an easy, easy guess. Let's, let's get it going. Hey, Paul, um, Kawhi Leonard is coming up on a similar situation as this season as you had last season. Mm -hmm. um, has he reached out to you, or do you have any anything that you can offer to him maybe as he goes through this process uh, this year? Uh, I actually, me and Kawhi are pretty close. Um, actually, during the summer, we hung out and, and kind of talked and got together a little bit. Um, and, and and we did talk a little bit on that, but um, at the end of the day, just told him just be open. Um, you know, we're both Southern Cal guys, and you know, we we both wanted to come home and play home, play for the city. Um, but obviously, you know, my situation came up, and I was happy with it. Um, just told him be open about it. You know, be open about the situation, uh, and, and just give wherever he goes. You know, at that time, we didn't know where he was going. Just told him, give wherever you're going. Give him your everything and, um, you know, decide from